Good evening, America, and welcome to the Nightly News. The nation is in mourning today as the death toll from the virus has just surpassed 700,000 Americans. The U.S. stock market hit another all-time low this afternoon as more and more businesses close their doors. The Center for Disease Control has requested that states close their borders to prevent the spread of the virus. Meanwhile, the president asked the nation to remain calm. We could not survive the virus. We fought as hard as we could, but nothing seemed to slow it down. It was as if the virus had stripped us of our humanity and revealed our true human nature that craved only one thing, and that's conflict. Demonstrators attacked police in the Capitol again today, as what started as a non-violent protest against federal mandates has now turned into an all-out insurrection. The U.S. ambassador to the United Nations addressed the General Assembly about the growing threat of the Russian and North Korean military maneuvers in the Pacific. This axis of evil must be stopped before it is too late. If only we had known then the consequences of our actions and realized that conflict breeds only one thing, and that is war. Those of us lucky enough to survive the war now struggle to stay alive in a lawless and bloody land. I will keep moving west, in search of a place that may not exist, but I will only reach my destination if God wills it. <laughs>